Hello, everyone. Welcome to Stone International Wellness Center podcast. And today I have a privilege with me right here on my right hand side, a beautiful soul inside and out. Thank you. Katrina Dalway. Everyone known her as Lady Diamond. Yes. And so um, there is so much about her I wanted to share. But I wanted to jump on here to share with you a little bit about how Lady Diamond have really experienced at Stone International Wellness Center. Yeah. And she's going to share with you her thought on that. How are you? I'm well, and thank you so much for having me here today. Oh, yeah. This is so, so nice, so wonderful, so amazing. And it's just very exciting to continue to watch you flourish. And it's so well-deserved at the same time um, with everything that you're doing. You know, I've been very, very fortunate to be one of your clients um, uh, the last couple of years. And it just has continued to improve my life well-being. Um, I have been one who... You know, I like certain things to eat, but that doesn't necessarily mean that that's good for your body. And so I had to learn, you know, through uh, QC, Dr. QC is what she needs. No, <laughs> no, but she needs to be, you know, she needs her accolades, you guys. She's doing some serious, amazing things, but she really changed the game for me and, and really helped me get on the right path to wellness. And I thank you so much for that. Um, and it's all happening right here at Stone International Wellness. And you guys, she knows her stuff. She literally knows her stuff. I'm looking at the wrong camera. Hi! She knows her stuff. And so it's really important to uh, acknowledge someone that is truly impacting individuals' lives like QC is. And, you know, and of course, you know, the, all the other amazing things that she's doing selflessly to impact the community. So for her to make it her business to help people coming to more of a healthier mindset um, is really, really good, and that's what she's done for me. Well, thank you so much. You know, it is so hard and um, to describe about how humble I am when I have an opportunity to to serve uh, amazing clients such as Lady Diamond. But one of the things that I know in all of our community, regardless of where you come from and what community you come from, many many people understand there's cupping, you know, and everyone know about it because there's you start seeing some pictures and things on celebrity. But the way we do it here is we utilize the modern technology mm -hmm. and holistic wellness that combine those two together because we believe even Eastern and Western, and every single podcast, I think I emphasize on that. It is so important. Medicine mm. and uh, Western doctors and hospital is for its intended use. Yeah. However, you, just like that Lady Diamond, can definitely do things as preventative. Mm -hmm. And then if you have got stuck, for some folks that have been losing weight like crazy because mm. – um, they, they got stuck and they didn't realize until we go in there and we find the right meridian and before we can understand uh, every single thing that is happening, we really get right there and targeting yeah. and getting your goal to where you need it to be. So if anybody out there have never done fire cupping, explain to them how you experience and what, how, what do you think? Well, the, the results... <laughs> are truly amazing um and uh, you know the rock he gets this done because it helps yeah. cleanse it helps purge the body the cupping does um and you're left with your body feeling whole but one of the things that i like about uh qc's technique is that she can literally look at you and identify where to specifically target the the cupping and that's phenomenal, and, and not everybody has the ability to do what she mm -hmm. does in terms of identifying, really pinpointing where to to um, do a majority of the cupping. You know, if if, if you have, say, for instance, um, you know, you may have some kidney issues right there. Mm -hmm. You know, she can literally see where that is, where that impact, that negative impact is happening in your body, and she will literally target that 
area for cupping, which really is absolutely amazing for you to be Thank able to identify that. Thank you so that. much. Thank you. Yeah. We, we focus on a lot of, of, of our client, our patient, doctor patient come in and say, you know, QC, do you guys do uh, colon cleanser? I mean, for me, I totally understand what that means, and I know that sometimes when we see things happening in the market, we really wanted to know. But not only that we focus is on your colon, we focus on your whole entire organ system, skeleton system, your muscle system, everything as a whole. Like, for example, many of you probably will not know this, but your colon your, your, is as large as a tennis court. Yeah. Isn't that crazy? That's you know, no nobody realized they're like, What? Yes. If you really hold wow your large and smart intestine and you stretch it out, it is as big as a, a wow. tennis court. All of that in our body. Yes. All of that compacted into our body. Mm -hmm. Yet she has the ability to be able to help cleanse that through cupping. It's like a vacuum, guys. It's like it's vacuuming your body yes. and it's real. Unclog everything it, it's unclogging. It can remove blood clots. Yes, that's you right. You know, uh, it's unbelievably mm -hmm. amazing. It's almost like a mini surgery. Yes, yes. So people are loving it so much. Yes, and we have one yes. patient just left a while ago. He's like, what did you do to me? I went to the bathroom three times. Yeah. And so we, at first, yeah. identify your body. We understand different type of toxicity. We understand different type of fat cells. Yeah. And then we understand uh, what we need to do to collate with your medicine, which is your food. Yes. Yes. And so you have been doing that and yes. doing phenomenal. Yes. You yes. look yes. incredible. Yes. Well, not only does she do the cupping, which is... You know, now, guys, let me say this is not the most comfortable thing, mm. but it is the most effective thing. That's right. And how, what do we say? The things that are good for you are always not always the, you know, the, the tastiest when it comes to food, etc. Well, it's not the most comfortable, but it is one of the most effective ways to truly uh, cleanse, cleanse uh, your body. Um, and the other thing is she does this, the facial. Yeah, the lymphatic uh, drainage. The lymphatic drainage. Well, we it lifted my skin's tone at yeah. least a couple of shades. Yeah. And I and when I came in um, a few weeks ago, I really wasn't feeling my best. And she was able to identify <laughs> certain things, you know. And I wasn't, at that time, I kind of fell off the wagon. I, you know, went through some traumatic experiences with my father's passing. And so mm -hmm. kind of got off uh, uh, a little bit. But she was able to get me back on, totally dr uh, drained my lymphatic Yes, yeah, system, uh, all system, the clog all of up. that, all of the, it was clogged up and everything, and and I could feel it when I walked in. I was like, everything was almost at a distance. You know, things didn't feel like they we were. I didn't feel present. Yeah. And um, after yeah. that, she, you know, after the lymphatic drainage, it is extremely important. It's not just cleansing your lymph nodes. It mm -mm, truly mm -mm, is no. doing so go so much deeper. Share with them. Yeah, right? yeah, that's absolutely. Incredible. It's so incredible. Absolutely. So been in the health and wellness in the Western world for 30 years here in America, over 30 years. I totally get it. I understand. Every single thing about outside cosmetic patient come in and, and said, hey, can you just do a microdermabrasion or non-surgical facelift or uh, oxygen treatment or something for me? But literally, before you can look your best outside, we dive deep in your root cause. And because of all that and because of I've been involved in so much in different type of manufacture, different equipment, as well as product line worldwide. Yeah. I understand that. So I built a custom program with just 30 different treatments all in once because wow. nobody have time no more. So literally this 35-minute treatment it is a game changer. It is where people feel like, hey, you know, I have an earache. I really do want to go get acupuncture. Is it? It's where people say, oh my God, my skin's so dehydrated. That is it. People say, oh wow, you know, I'm so heavily sinuses pressure. We did that. And and the list can just go on. Oh, I just really want my skin tightening. We did that. Uh, what about some of these lines? And I'm not ready yet for Botox or filler. We did that. Literally, I tried to build 30 of this type of treatment 
into ones because what happened is when you unclog and you can we can make it where you build your own collagen, you build your own natural fiber and your uh, fiber blast and and fat tissue, then you start getting plum up your skin. Mm. Your skin beginning to have more oxygenated. Mm. Your eye that you've been on Zoom all day long beginning to lip and brightening. And so literally it's all of that type of treatment into one 35-minute treatment. Yeah. We yeah. wanted to do that because, like I said, you know, a lot of patients are um, – or out of times yeah. and yeah. busy and times is an essence and time is money so therefore it's very very important for us so we just call it real simplicity it's a lymphatic drainage treatment. well i feel i feel every bit of it i feel like um you know um it it affects the entire body yeah. uh as well and it left me very very um rejuvenated I felt so refreshed and so rejuvenated That's so, from awesome. it. so you're doing a lot of things well thank you so much yeah. but anyway well beside every single things we love it so much to, to be a modern holistic path for Lady Diamond and for you out there that watching this YouTube video be sure to go like and subscribe with everything that we do however be, before we go off I really wanted to share with you a little bit about her she's an incredible not only that you would see her at a gospel brunch um at the house of blue but she have had <clears throat> founded this amazing organization called you can live again and last year i have a privilege to receive an award uh for the source of hope called you can live again that's why you saw this beautiful handmade um plaque right yeah. here yeah. and so I wanted to share with you a little bit about her organization not only that she's having some health and wellness expos she having so many different things happening so I am not gonna let her share that with you right now well here's the deal <laughs> um you can live again um is basically my story of uh believing self in believing in myself uh, believing in self care and how important it is um, and I'm glad that I experienced what I did experience because it allowed me to really see how important self-belief is um, I have I'm one that I had a very exceptional upbringing as a child and but I was the rebel and I chose to go off and explore the world. I was done with classical piano and Catholic school. I was just like, ah, I want to see what else is out there. And boy, did I see it. And, you know, I did make mistakes. And I see how people frown at you when you do make those mistakes. And you're left feeling alone. You're left feeling, hey, what do I do? How do I, you know, come back from this? And, you know, I thought this person would be here for me or this person would be there when I really had to do a self check. And it was also a spiritual thing too for me as well. And so I said, you know what? I'm gonna choose to believe in myself. There's a higher power. God believes in me. So if I know that he believes in me, I'm okay. Mm -hmm. I can move on. Right. I can get on, you know, past That's right. it. Mm -hmm. And that was, You're right. yeah, that was my step into going into that, but I, even though I was still striving, like you see, striving to, to be who I am, I was still helping other individuals become right. who yeah. they are too. You know, because that's so important. Yeah, you create this beautiful platform. Yeah, and so, and when you um, are, are going through that, you know, mm. um, type of, of um, experience. experience, then it's so important to also help pe other people along the way. And so I found that there were people also that were impacting other individuals' lives outside of myself mm. while they were going through their trials, and they've done amazing things. And so we came up initially with the You Can Live Again um, magazine, and um, and so after that, after you know working with a lot of, of different events, et cetera, being the MC of the House of Blues, which is like you know what I knew I was put on this earth to do, I really wanted to also help other individuals believe in themselves and provide them with strategies mm -hmm. of believing in themselves. And mm -hmm. so during COVID, it just hit me like a ton of bricks. 
literally it was truly a spiritual experience that I knew I had to do and the timing was right to do and so we actually debuted the inaugural yeah you can live again brunch and awards and then we had the gala at at and performing arts inside the Dean Charles uh, Wiley Theater, which was an amazing event. Oh, it was well. so beautiful. <laughs> it was so beautiful. It was packed full, sold yeah. out event. Yes, it was. It was. And we were really excited to really present something. I wanted you all to feel special that it night. It was so special. I wanted you guys to feel special at the expo um, yeah. at last year um, yeah. at the Brunch Awards announcements. But I wanted to, and that was just a segue, you know. So I wanted the the event to just be, you yeah. know, you all are amazing, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. we want to make sure that make sure why that this, the event. You know, this is what happening when you do live podcast. <laughs> Sorry about that. Hey, but, life happens. I, yeah. I, I, done TV, all that stuff happens, yes. and you just keep flowing, honey. You just you keep got, going. You just keep going. Natural is always good. That's right. People mm -hmm. love that, yeah. and I love that, and I love, you know, so it's all good. But, um, but yeah, and so that, that night to celebrate you, to celebrate oh. all the other individuals, mm -hmm. you know, for, so for yeah, to have the experience, the life experience that God trusted you to have mm -hmm. because he knew that you would help somebody else. Oh. To celebrate individuals like that. You know, this year we're celebrating some pretty amazing people. Oh, some amazing. One of the ladies that we are, that is really near and dear to my heart, is a lady by the name of Nancy Bowman. Oh, yeah. And um, she it has created a haven for young kids mm. whose parents have been killed or committed suicide. Mm. Mm. And so she, she did not just have a You Can't Live Again story herself that was, you know, wow. dramatic. Or, but she knew it was her call. And so many individuals out there that are, like, are, are literally like that. And I'm looking for you, too. And yes. I'm finding you, too. Um, and God is bringing you to me, too, as well. But yeah. we celebrate those individuals that care about helping others. That have done so many things yes. without any yeah. platform or even yeah. wanted to be recognized. And That's I mean, key to me, not yeah. wanting to be recognized. Kim Cummings, yes. not wanting oh to be my recognized. Gosh, yes. you By know. President HR of yeah. Children's Hospital. Amazing. Oh, it's just, you know, very, very humble. And very humble. Yeah, to know? be in the room with so many amazing, incredible leaders like yeah, that, that's yeah. really humbling. The day experience. is going to be amazing, and we're excited about um, our MC for the day. It's going to be Hannah Davis oh. of Good Morning Texas. Wow! And so we are looking forward to the award recipients being, you know, interviewed by her and, oh. and telling their story. So you know, you know, we I've been working, Q. I've been working. Oh yeah, you're working. <laughs> I'm sorry, oh. I call it Q. QC. 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 Yeah. But um, so um, we are really excited about celebrating um, them on May the 21st um, at Edison's venue, which is a beautiful venue. Yes. Uh, it has so much personality and to be able to provide that type of, of acknowledgement um, for them is exciting. Mm -hmm. Well, you know, I mean, we can just go on. Me yes. and her, we yes. are enjoying this yes. podcast. Yes, yes, We're yes. enjoying just to share and things like that. But you know what? That's to show you when your cup will overly flow mm. and full, you can't let it run to the ground. You, can't you let share. It run. That's right. And that's what we do. We share. Perfect. That's really we share, good. You know, yeah. and so um, we continue to share our health and wellness journey as well as the story you can live again. Mm -hmm. If you watch this video and you feel encouraged about this, please be sure to go like and subscribe on her channel too as well and we will have all that link for you to subscribe but also if there's any way that stone international wellness yes. center can serve you in your health and wellness regardless of what it is if you feel stuck uh you wanted to lose five pounds but you don't know how call us uh your child experienced a 14 years old with severe acne and you just don't know what is happening or your you know um 
sometimes children don't listen to their parents, but they will listen to us. Or we have a six years old coming to here that's swimming in the public pool and have severe ear infection with our Western doctor have two ear tubes on it. It's not working out until the mother brought that child here because the teacher said she cannot focus in school anymore. QC, wow. please help. So just in one treatment, we can find and identify that and drain, and that baby is whole again, swimming at the public pool again, you know. Wow. So uh, regardless of what it is, don't think your problem is a heavy, big, problematic. It might be just a small little smidge that we can unclog it for you. So um, our phone number here is 972-473-2205, and it's not about how many patients that we can connect or how many celebrity patients or our you know, Michelin chef travel from Dubai here or whatever, regardless of who you are, our goal and with our foundation called The Source of Hope is to serve our community. And that's exactly why we opened here. We would have an opportunity to, to expand to multiple, multiple clinics, but we just want it to be uh, a nice setting and we wanted to be education we wanted to broadcast it out so um, regardless of where you lived we have people travel from all over the world here so we're very very grateful and you know and I want to add something because she's being modest <laughs> you know she is a highly sought after holistic practitioner Thank you we say so it like much. that and celebrities come here to see her and want to have her help them. Yeah. So, you know, she's doing a lot of amazing things, and I, I just so believe in her and believe in what she has been purposed to do. So just know that it's she's doing some pretty amazing things for a lot of amazing people from the smallest to the greatest. So And, yeah. and the, what I appreciate about her is she still wants to help those who, um, you know, really don't have the status, you know, That's don't right. have, but she wants it's more to. more important, it's, yes. Yeah, yeah. And then to provide a school yes. for people to spread this type of wellness um, um, strategy. Practitioner, yes. Practitioner, opportunity, um, life skill. That's right. That's a beautiful thing. Economic development. Economic what, development, yeah. Yeah, that's what you we know. do. You know, we started out in Grand Prairie and helped be part of that 9,000 yeah. businesses that bring into the city of Grand Prairie. Yes, and yes. For us, it's all also it's diversity, mm -hmm. equity, inclusion, mm -hmm. belonging. Yes. So you can be a diversity, equity, inclusion. I like but that. But you must help people find their belonging because it's a tough world out there so regardless of what you doing you know that is good. everyone can uh it, it's not just about pull them a chair to the table yeah it's pull them to a chair to the table and for my my thing is a lot of time when i saw my sister and brother out there did not want to pull the chair to that table i pull them a chair to the table but also i like to identify their gift and allow them to belong. That's right. So diversity, equity, inclusion, belonging is very important for the Source of Hope, our foundation, as well as we are celebrating amazing, um, you know, Pac uh, Island Pacific uh, Island Month, which is the month of May. Mm -hmm. And so- I wanna go to Ireland. Yeah, so t take a look at uh, Lady Diamond and, and myself, you know, we are very diverse. So yeah. thank you for yes. always being a part of, of that course. diverse. For sure, for life. You uh -huh. know, and thank you so much, everyone, for joining in here. Do you have anything else you want to share? Other than that, you guys, you know, she really said a mouthful in terms of belonging and, you know, just find that place in you, you know, find that center in you, um, have that self-belief. Yes. Try your best to look within and find you. And trust me, you can live again. Yes, you can live again. And if you are on the wrong circle, maybe you're there and you doesn't feel belonging. Uh, take yourself out of that circle. You have to. You yes. have to take yourself, take yourself out where you don't belong. Don't try to fit in where you feel no, like no, 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 no. It's not comfortable. You value. You, you value. You value. And you, yes. know, I, you know, I've always been very passionate about being where you are 
received. You know, Jesus went to where he was received. That's right. That's you know, right. and so you have to remember that part of it because it's so much more flourishing. Yeah. So much more nourishing when you are where you are received and mm -hmm. where people just want to support you and just right. want to push you. Mm -hmm. you know? And it could be so uncomfortable to yeah. step out of your comfort zone. Yeah. But yeah. I promise you, as soon as you step out of that comfort zone, there are so many more doors that That's God right. is opening. That's right. You know, That's and, right. and it could be where I have a, a, a one individual last night um, messenger me at 12.30 last night. Mm. And I never looked in my Facebook or messenger and stuff like that. And it's happened to where I need to grab my phone, look it up, and that individual really in need uh, mm -hmm. of, of our, our, our service and our need. But, you know, that just a nudge of whatever it is in people's heart, mm -hmm. when God designed that uh, feeling, that discernment, yeah. you know, I call it the Holy Spirit, yeah. do it. Yeah. And it could be so uncomfortable. If you start feeling, oh, my God, I'm not belonging here, step back, step back. and look inside that window and that's realize right. that you not belong there so it's time to go that's right and it's then. time to go and let me tell you sometimes the boomerang effect does happen mm -hmm. but it happens because there are things that are ha that need to take place while you're in that boomerang mode mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you know and um she sees the leader mm -hmm. um and i've always said this this is a queen she's a <sighs> queen and she's just doing she's so amazing, amazing things, you know, stepping into her own lane. Yes, you stay know? in your own lane. Stay in your don't, own don't lane. Don't try to figure out what people do. Don't look in that social yeah. media. Yeah. Because everything is your own table. She's created yeah. her own table. Hello. That's, some, that's right. That's, that's some food for thought. That's she right. has now created her own table. That's right. And it's powerful. Yes. Mm -hmm. And my grandmother, as being an orphanage, always said, you know, regardless of what it is, you know, if you want to be the best leader, you first have to become a follower. And for me, I follow every single one of our lead um, and, and to learn, learn from the young, the old, the medium, yeah. whatever. Yeah. So then that's way you can have that process yeah. and progress. Yes. And that's, and that's all with um, servantry, yes. having a servant's heart, yes. you know. And, and that's what Jesus did. Jesus served his, his disciples' feet, he, yes, you yes. know. And, um, and so that's the strategy. If you, if, if you ever need a strategy, if you ever need a template, a guideline, mm. Jesus went and then Jesus served yes. at the same time. And then he became head. That's right. Head of the cornerstone, that's you know. Right. And that's exactly what her process and her walk has been. So That's right. Mm -hmm. Our body is God's temple, everyone. I always remind everybody <laughs> about that. And so if you really want to look radiance from the outside, you must have to have the whole from the inside. Yeah. Well, before I drop this podcast off, I really want to give my amazing credit to our incredible team at The Source of Hope. See how my hair today curly? It is from one of so our cute. amazing educators. Claire Montenegro. Uh, I don't want her to call herself Claire Montenegro. I call her Claire Stone. She's my daughter. Oh, <laughs> like. so sweet. But she have really floors, and she have done so much. And I, I'm beautiful. going to get her on podcast one day. She's always behind the scene. Twelve year with me. Wow. She behind the scene, and that's one of and the quiet. Things quiet. So I said, <laughs> I really want her to come to the front and let everybody know about this hair. She does hair service and all mm -hmm. of this cosmetic procedures and so on at the source of hope. And that proceed go serve our homeless monthly. That's wonderful. Monthly. So anyway, so I thought I just wanted to throw that in there. So y'all stay <laughs> tuned for Claire. I'm going to get Claire up here on about uh, uh, another time. But we love you all so much. Thank you for letting me and my beautiful sister in Christ right here. Yes, isn't she so beautiful? I hope you stay tuned to You Can Live Again. Get your ticket to the podcast and then make sure to go straight to her website uh, for the gala because it will be so out. I'm so excited. So excited. Thank you so very much.